here with uh, Bill Bits from Discover at Home Inspections, and we are going to be taking a look at fireplaces. So, Bill, what do you look for when you're inspecting a chimney? Like, what are all the different components? Uh, let's start with the firebox here. This is obviously where all the action takes place, if you will. Um, you burn in here. Above that, you have a damper, which leads to a smoke shelf into a flue, and that's how all the smoke exits. The flue is lined by the chimney, which is what we see at the exterior. Mm -hmm. At the top of the chimney, you'll have a crown, which needs to be maintained. Um, if not, you're looking for water intrusion and deterioration of the structure. On top of the flue, you should have a metal flue cap, which prevents um, birds and rain from getting in. Or in this case, a good example, leaves have entered because there's no flue cap at the top. Okay, so the fact that there's leaves at the bottom of this means that there's no flue cap at the top, so that's something that you would Correct. definitely flag on this. Yep, so I would definitely recommend a metal flue cap. I can make that recommendation just by seeing this without even being outside. Okay, so what are some uh, common issues that you come across? Common issues are deteriorated flue towels. Um, heavy creosote. Creosote is the byproduct of burning firewood. Deteriorated fluid tiles would lead to um, smoke entering a living space, potential carbon monoxide entering a living space, and then that, that can all be repaired by inserting a liner, stainless steel liner. Okay, okay. So that's a common mitigation method, isn't it? Yep, very right? common that flues, chimneys, fireboxes in one way, shape, or form need some sort of maintenance or repair. So, Bill, can you tell me a little bit about some of the exterior components? Like, what's something that could go wrong there? What's, what are things that you look for? Typically, the, the biggest problems with the exterior are crown maintenance. If the crown's not maintained, you're looking at water intrusion. Uh, freeze thaw cycles can expand and contract, causing the cement roof to crack and become brittle. Um, it gets down into the brick, the mortar can start to fail. The longer that's left to be, the more expensive it will become to fix. And how, uh, how often would you recommend that homeowners, once the purchase has been made, how often would you recommend that somebody has their chimney inspected? Chimney inspected, at least have a flue cleaned every two cord of firewood. A cord of firewood is a stack of wood that's four feet tall, four feet wide, and eight feet long, so it's a lot of wood. Um, every two cord, you should have the flue cleaned, and at that rate, they should also be inspecting it as well. 